be right there. No one in or out of this hallway. Why do you think that guy is unarmed? Who knows? Maybe he was trying to smother Rojas or unplug his life support. Or maybe he's a distraction and someone else is going for the cookie jar. What? Hi, Pam. Hi, Jake. Don't come any closer or I'll blow us both up. You weren't supposed to be here. This wasn't part of the plan. It's okay, Pam. No need to panic. We're just talking. Look, I'm just going to put this away. Nope, Terry, don't open that, please. What's going on in there? There is a woman in here with an explosive device. What? You okay? Yep, everyone is fine. I just need you to evacuate this entire floor, call ESU and the bomb squad right away, and jam all cellular and Wi-Fi signals. On it. Okay, Pam, so we're just going to stay calm here and talk this thing through as friends. This isn't supposed to be happening. The man said that I'd be able to sneak in here unnoticed. What man? Who asked you to do this? I didn't get his name, but he was very attractive. Antonio Banderas could play him in a movie. What has he been doing lately? You know what? He should be on Outlander. Okay, Pam, I'm going to cut you off, but it's not because I'm not interested. I'm sorry. I'm nervous. I get chatty when I get nervous. This man who gave you the bomb, did he happen to mention whether or not it's on a timer or if there's a remote detonator? I don't know. I'm terrible with electronics. I wish my son Bobby were here. He taught me how to iPad. Okay, I also know how to iPad, so maybe I could take a look. Stay where you are! The man told me that when I got the bomb set, I should text him with his phone, and if anything went wrong, I should push this button. No, 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 no. You don't want to do that. Yes, I do. I have to. Well, there's only one thing to do when two people have diametrically opposing opinions on a subject. Structure debate. What? Yeah, I just learned about it. All right, I will argue the negative. I don't want to blow up, and you can argue the affirmative. You do want to blow up, which I have to say, Pam, is a very tough stance to take. I don't want to blow up, but the man said he'd give me $500,000. This is so Bobby can take care of my granddaughter. That girl means the world to me. Fine, fine, point to Pam. But if you care about her so much, how can you just blow yourself up? You'll never get to see her again. Well, at least I know she'll be financially well taken care of. Sure, but is this really how you want her to remember you? As a murderer? I'd rather be remembered as a woman who blew up a mobster to help her family rather than a librarian whose bowels are tied up like a sailor's knot. Okay, that's a very strong argument. Very strong. But you're forgetting one thing. You're not just going to be killing a mobster. You're also going to be killing me. He said the blast would only hurt people in the room. You could just walk right out of here. Pam, you know I can't do that. Now please... Just give me the bomb. And then what? Bobby doesn't get any money and I go to jail? I can't go to jail. Every roommate I've ever had has hated me. In college, I had a roommate named Mary Ellen, and she was dating the brother of Steve Gutenberg. Pam, what are we talking about here? I'm sorry. I'm really nervous. Wait, 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 wait. I know it probably feels like you don't have a lot of options right now. In fact, this whole situation probably feels like... Like a twisted bell. But it's not. There's still one end of this bell that's open. Which end? The butt end. I'm listening. Okay, if you hand me that bomb right now, nothing bad will have happened. And that'll be because of you, because you cooperated. Also, I'm sure a judge would understand how you got into this situation. I mean, you were asked to do this by an Antonio Banderas type. Who could say no to that? And even if you do go to prison, it is going to be such a fancy prison. With a lot of crafts? Yes, with tons of crafts. Pam, listen to me. Let's untwist this bell together. Let's clear everything out. Okay. Uh, you did great, Pam. Thank you. Now that it's out of my hands, I can see it really is a bomb. Yes, yes it is. <laughs> oh my God, get some help! Okay. Okay.